everybody. Welcome back to Cantonese food recipes. Today I am making a salt and pepper spicy fried chicken recipe. As you can see on this uh, video, it's very crispy and delicious with all that uh, colorful red, green, yellow, green peppers with some onions and a piece of chili. So it's very spicy and tasty. Just look at this chicken, it's very crispy and delicious. Look at it, I'm cutting it now. Check at it, very juicy and tender. Just take a look at that. Oh, you guys, just continue watching this video and I'll show you guys how to make some of this delicious fried chicken. Okay, guys, so let's get uh, cooking. So let's see the ingredients here. So first here I'm chopping up a piece of uh, garlic. And then here I've got uh, one piece of chili. Then the chili we're just gonna chop it up as well. Chop it up and just dump it in a bowl. And then here we can just cut a piece of uh, onion and also finely chop it up. Finely chop it up nicely. And, fin and finally, we will have some uh, red, green, and yellow uh, bell peppers. Just finely chop it up as well, as you can see. Here's the green one. Just chop it up. Finally, here's the yellow one. Just cut a little piece. We don't need uh, too much uh, peppers when we stir fry our fried chicken. Okay. Let me show you guys how to marinate the chicken thighs here. Here I got uh, some salt, sprinkle some salt there as well. Uh, here I got some white pepper, sprinkle white pepper. All around the chicken thighs. Here I got some black pepper, also sprinkle uh, all around the chicken thighs. Here I got uh, half a teaspoon of uh, brown sugar. Here I got uh, one teaspoon of chicken powder. And then uh, I'm just gonna put on a plastic glove and just give it a quick mix before I add in the wet ingredients. Wet ingredients, I'm adding two teaspoons of soy sauce. And then uh, one teaspoon of um, uh, sesame oil, one teaspoon of uh, Chinese rice wine and uh, one teaspoon of oyster sauce. Here is about 600 grams in chicken thighs, five pieces. And now I'm just gonna give it a quick mix as well. Okay, after mixing, we can crack one egg and also just uh, give it a quick mix. Then I'm gonna add in two heaped uh, teaspoons of uh, corn starch or corn flour and also just give it a quick mix there okay once it's mixed we can just leave it to rest for 20 minutes before we coat it so here i've got some corn flour we add some salt and some white pepper and then i'm just gonna use my chopsticks and give it a quick mix So after quick mix and after chicken's marinated, we can just put our pieces of chicken thighs uh, on top of the corn starch. Get a bigger plate. I uh, using here a little small plate, which is not cool. Yeah, and then just um, just uh, move it around. Uh, try to coat the chicken with the corn flour. You don't need to like coat it fully, it's just a little coat all around the chicken pieces. And then that's it. And then now we can preheat our oil. So the oil here, I've preheated it at about 200 degrees Celsius. So now just dumping the chicken. So each piece of chicken I put in, but then I also turn down the heat to about 140 degrees. Okay, so we're gonna be deep frying these pieces of uh, chicken for about 15 minutes. So about three to four minutes, just give it a quick flip around. As you can see. 
three to four minutes, give it a quick flip or else it will burn. As you can see, the color is starting to turn uh, very crispy, very golden color. Okay guys, so like we, we, we're gonna fry this for about 10 minutes and then in the last five minutes, we're gonna up the heat to about 180 degrees to really give it a good uh, crispy skin feeling on the chicken thighs. So the last uh, the last five minutes, just uh, turn up the heat and then just keep on moving the chicken around. Make sure each piece of chicken is uh, well uh, browned and golden. As you can see now, it's uh, completed. Very crispy and delicious. Look at that color of that fried chicken pieces. Wow, you can just eat it just like that if you don't want it to be spicy, guys. So the, the rest of the ingredients, I just um, pan fried it in a wok with some uh, olive oil. And then before I dump in the fried chicken, just to give it a good stir fry. And then that's it. Very easy, guys, to make this uh, spicy salt and pepper fried chicken fries, guys. Very delicious. Okay, guys. Thanks, guys, for watching my uh, video tutorial on making this fried chicken. If you like my recipes on my channel, please uh, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys for watching, see you guys next time, bye bye.